artistas, this is Miss Polly's y bienvenidos. Did you know that the world needs innovative thinkers? Being innovative means to introduce something new or different, and artists often use innovative ideas in their work. In nuestra última clase, we talked about the importance of using our imaginations and creativity. Hoy, we will begin drawing an innovative creature and habitat. Vámonos! Let's learn more. Hoy, we will use our imagination to draw a new creative creature and habitat. But before we begin, what is a habitat? ¿Qué es? Un habitat is the natural home or environment of an animal. So, how can you construct a habitat for your creative creature? You can actually use tu imaginación. Let's take a look at a few artists who use their imaginations to draw creative and surreal landscapes. Leonora Carrington was a British Mexican painter known for her surrealist work. Notice how she includes many different creative creatures in her paintings. There are so many intricate details. Which ones stand out to you? Conan Lim was born and raised in the Philippines where he discovered his passion for art. Later, he moved to Dubai to work as an architect, but he still continues to paint. His cute characters are based on childhood nostalgia. What memories do you have of certain places that you can include in your habitat? Dorothea Tanning was an American surrealist painter. Tanning often used her own dreams as inspiration for her work. How can you use your dreams to help inspire a creative habitat for your creature? Kayla Mahaffey was born and raised in Chicago, Illinois. Her colorful paintings contain hints of whimsy and realism that tell a story of inner thoughts that sometimes go unheard. Notice how she combines both realistic and cartoon-like images. What realistic or whimsical details can you add to your work? Salvador Dali was a Spanish artist renowned for his technical skill, precise craftsmanship, and bizarre imagery in his work. Notice the melting clocks and the persistence of memory on the left. How will you take your time to complete your work? Nicoletta Coccoli was born and lives in San Marino, Italy. She's illustrated numerous books and has worked as a character designer. How can you tell a story with your creature and habitat? The first thing you're going to want to draw today is your creative creature. Let's take another look at the artists we learned about last class. Do any of these artists inspire you? Remember to use your imagination and draw something no one's ever seen before. Empieza by drawing some geometric and organic shapes. This pues, draw all of your creative details. Be sure to use your imagination. Your creature will likely need to have the following body parts. Una cabeza, orejas, ojos, cuello, nariz, boca, cuerpo, y brazos o piernas. Some additional details you might want to include are a tail, fin, wings, horns, Spikes, scales, feathers, fur, hair, a trunk or a beak, tentacles, a shell, and more. Remember, these are just ideas to get you started. This is your creative creature, so it can look however you want it to. Take a look at how I use geometric and organic shapes to begin drawing my creature. Then, I added details to my work. Notice how I use my imagination and transform some familiar elements to create something new. Finally, I began drawing my habitat with a horizon line. Then, I added realistic and whimsical details to the foreground, middle ground, and background. Notice how the objects in the foreground appear larger than those in the background. Now it's your turn! Primero, begin by imagining what creature you want to create. Take a look back at your ideas that you sketched last class. 
Después, draw your creature. Recuerda to use shapes and add details. Finalmente, dibuja a creative habitat for your creature. Be sure to only use a pencil today, as we'll add color next class. Take your time and do your best work. Well, I hope you enjoyed learning about the importance of creativity and imagination. And I can't wait to see what innovative creatures and habitats you draw. Para la próxima clase, make sure you bring your drawing as we begin to add color. Recuerda that the world needs innovative thinkers. So how will you continue to think of and explore new ideas? Until next time, adios artistas. Mm -hmm.